All right, now to our big story of the morning. Today, Governor Cooper is going to announce his plans for North Carolina schools in the fall. Wake Up Charlotte's Richard Vane joins us now live. And Richard, the first day of school now uh, just more than a, a month away. So teachers, parents, students all anxiously awaiting this decision. Absolutely correct, Ben. And it's important to note that basically the governor will say today he will lay out his plan, which will provide a broad minimum requirement or mandate, if you will, for schools. Schools can impose stricter uh, guidelines if they want to, but at least they'll know the minimum of what the governor expects as we head back into the next school year. This is a tough call. Uh, how how to open up schools. But it's a call Governor Cooper will make today on the plan to reopen schools in the state. He had originally delayed his announcement until today to get more feedback from health professionals on the effects of COVID-19 on children. The emerging scientific evidence suggests that going to school is less of a risk as we think about the potential spread of COVID-19. School districts have already been tasked with preparing for three scenarios, minimal social distancing, moderate social distancing, and remote learning only. Cooper appears to be leaning toward a plan that's a combination of virtual and in-person instruction. We wanna get our students back in the classroom and we wanna make sure that we get this right, to make sure that our schools are opening in the safest possible way. Yeah, absolutely correct. That's what the governor says to open the schools in the safest possible way. He'll have that announcement today at three o'clock. Of course, we'll have it here live as well as online at WCNC.com. We're in West Charlotte, Richard Devane for Wake Up Charlotte.